You're kidding me on, Michael Stewart was blown away, by the new Celtic boy. Dazen Maeda has taken to social media after making a winning and scoring start to his Celtic career. And Angie confirms Celtic exit. What a morning it is today on Tuesday the 18th of January 2022. Remember last summer, Celtic are doomed, they won't win anything, for the taking this season. Then we pull out the big Greek-born manager. Now let's talk about last night. Why a feckin' dancer a troops? Pundit Michael Stewart was in disbelief live on air tonight when told that new Celtic signing Rio Hattate only cost £1.4 million. Hattate produced an exquisite debut performance for the boys against Hibs tonight, especially in the first half. His technical ability, vision and work rate were all on full display as he ran the show in the middle of the park against Sean Maloney's side. On that showing, we've won a watch with this deal. Obviously there's a long way to go and he needs to show consistency, but the gut feeling on this one is very strong. Radio Scotland couldn't stop with the praise tonight, with Stuart in particular waxing lyrics about his ability. Back to Dazen Maeda. He has taken to social media after making a winning and scoring start to his Celtic career. The Japanese forward went straight into the Celtic starting 11 and it didn't take him long to get his account up and running. Dizen showed incredible bursts of pace throughout the game and helped Celtic press Hibernian out the game in the first half. There are similarities between Maeda and his countryman Kyogo. The striker thanked the fans for their support. His tweet at m underscore Dizen underscore 1020. Thank you all for your support tonight. I'm massively happy and looking forward to contributing more. Maeda is likely to feature more for Celtic in the coming weeks. Kyogo's injury is still being investigated by the Celtic physio team and they're unsure when the goal hero will be back in the team. The boys managed a 2-0 win against Hibernian on the evening and even though the second half was a bit more of a struggle, the team showed they can see out a game professionally. There were reports over the weekend on Lee Griffiths and his Celtic contract being terminated six months before it was scheduled to run out. The club had stayed quiet and hadn't put out any official communication to confirm the news. Angie Postacogla was asked after Celtic's victory against Hibernian if Lee's Celtic career was coming to an end. Angie confirmed it had ended. The Celtic manager went on to say. He can look back on his Celtic career with great pride. Celtic boss confirms striker Lee Griffith's career at the club is over and has wished the striker well for the future. He scored some amazing goals and helped win trophies. Angie Postacogla couldn't have asked for a better start from his January signings, as Rio Hattate and Dizen Maeda starred in Celtic's 2-0 win over Hibernian. Hattate, Maeda and Yosuke Idaguchi all made their debuts for the hoops after the trio moved over from the J-League in Japan with Maeda scoring his first goal for the club in the victory and Hattate collecting Man of the Match honours. It's a great day hope you don't have a hangover. Smile and wave and hope that other mobs slip up tonight. And on that note, have a great day Celtic fans. Lit. Roll up to the party, roll up, roll up to the party, roll up to the party, roll up, roll up to the party.